Hey, I'm back. So this week, I want to talk about how me working on changing my lifestyle and changing my life has had an effect on not only me, but it's had an effect on my family. And I want to make sure that I let people know that this is a process that affects everyone in your life. May it be your friends, your family, you know, it affects everyone. So I want to introduce you to my brother Michael, who has been, was diagnosed as pre-diabetic. And in being diagnosed as pre-diabetic, he decided to take up, change a lifestyle, change a life, and make a difference for himself. Here's Mike. Good morning. I'd like to share something with you this morning. My name is Mike. I'm Carl Brother. And uh, I went to the doctor about three months ago. And the doctor told me I was pre-diabetic. And the doctor wanted to put me on medication right then. I said, doctor, doctor, please give me one chance, doctor. Please, oh, Lord, don't do that to me, doctor. I said, look here. I'm going to get some of this weight off me. Before you put me on that medication, let me try to at least work out, get this weight off me, and try to reverse this thing. So she gave me a shot. I lost 15 pounds. My sugar level dropped by eight points. She said I'm on the right track. She'll give me three more months. I'll come back again. My sugar level dropped some more. That ain't gonna be no conversation. I'm walking between six and seven miles a day. I'm working out twice a day. As you can see now, I'm in the gym now. I'm in the gym now, I'm on a little exercise machine, on a leg lift machine. This is twice a day. I'm not playing with this thing. So when I come back to her in October, I'm gonna try to be down another 20 pounds. So I just want to let you know, for everybody that's out there that's struggling with this thing, you can reverse it. So I'll see you again in a few weeks, maybe Saturday. I'm planning on walking the Woodrow Wilson Bridge. I done done it the last two weekends, Saturday and Sunday. So i see you Saturday and Sunday on the Woodrow Wilson Bridge. Thank you. Have a good one. Hey, hey, hey. Now, we can't walk. I'm not going to walk eight miles a day, seven or eight miles a day like he just told you guys he did. Nor am I going to get up at the crack of dawn with him and walk the Woodrow Wilson Bridge every weekend. But he's moving, he's exercising, he's doing it twice a day. I applaud him. Good job. Keep up the good work. And let's continue to move, change our lives. Changing our lifestyles and changing our life is the most important thing we can do for ourselves to keep ourselves happy. See you.